to the battle for House Speaker. Jim Jordan is scrambling for support this morning after failing to win enough votes on his first try. Senior Congressional Correspondent Rachel Scott had the latest on Capitol Hill. Good morning, Rachel. Michael, good morning. Congressman Jim Jordan is now pleading with Republicans to stop attacking each other and come together. Well, with just hours to go until that next vote, some holdouts are only digging in. This morning, Congressman Jim Jordan preparing to force another vote for Speaker of the House, just hours after he was rejected by members of his own party. We thought we were uh, doing well, uh, that we were that area was a little, a little more maybe, but uh, we were we feel confident. Jordan could only afford to lose four Republicans. On the first ballot, he lost 20. The Speaker has not been elected. The Ohio congressman huddled with members on the House floor, his supporters tallying votes by hand. With Democrats remaining united, no I vote for Jeffries. The opposition from Republicans was far worse than Jordan was hoping for. The conservative firebrand and founder of the far right House Freedom Caucus has spent hours meeting with members. We need to get a speaker as soon as possible. He's known as a staunch defender of Donald Trump pushing false claims about the 2020 election, even appearing at a rally to protest the results. When I asked if he would acknowledge Trump lost, no response. Do you acknowledge that? Congressman Ken Buck of Colorado telling me that's one of the main reasons he will never support Jordan. I am not going to vote for Jim. I just don't think that we can win the presidential election uh, if we have candidates and leaders in our party who won't admit that Donald Trump lost. Jordan is now challenged with convincing over a dozen Republicans to back him, with the House at a standstill and just under 30 days until a government shutdown. Sources tell us that a few of those holdouts have been reluctant to even meet with Jordan again or return his phone calls. Not a good sign for him heading into this next vote, guys. What a crazy it situation really on Capitol is. Hill. Okay, Rachel, thanks very much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching. And we'll see you in the morning on GMA.